So, uh, someone wanted to see the predecessor. To I wrote this in about uh, nineteen. What I wanted to do was, uh, it's a DOS program, um, let's see if I can even remember it. So let's place. Um, Edit, let's see, edit. Environment. So you, oh, let's see how this works. I don't have a cursor. Oh well. Um, you place, uh, you can do rigid. It's basically just like sim structure, but for DOS, it's, it's not too. And you can make a movie. Now let's run it. Um, run. Let's see. How do you do this? Escape. Run. Tolerance. So it's like sim structure. You can set the charge. The original, um, I've seen a lot of people do this. Um, I, they probably don't use Runcutta. Um, it's the predecessor to sim structure. It had, uh, I started doing some matrices for, uh, Mat, it imports MATLAB matrices in order to do a, it will do a Lipunov function uh, uh, anyway it's there I've shown most of what it is um, so you can uh, you can set the charge I don't have a cursor that's kind of bad about all the uh oh now we're in trouble oh crap <laughs> uh, okay I killed it that's what I wanted to do so that's all there is to it. Um, it's I have the source code. Um, That's all my old files. Um, so.
so most of my work is uh, has been superseded by Temple OS. Temple OS, I guess it doesn't do everything that I ever did. Um, it, it's supposed to be a uh, replacement for uh, sim structure. Um, you can't really do something like this in sim structure. Or, or I'm sorry. Um, this is supposed to be this is this is like sim structure but um, more advanced um, with so unfortunately it takes a lot of work sim structure is simple um so uh it's not exactly a replacement for sim structure it's like uh it's only half as it only does half as much of the work but you can get better results but most people are the one thing i've learned over the years is uh people only scratch the surface um, whenever i've made when i made sim structure they they really just barely scratch the surface so like that's just what I assume um, nobody's got time to <laughs> so that's what I learned let's go let's talk with God And he that burneth her shall wa wash his clothes in, in water, and bathe his flesh in water, and shall be unclean until the even. And a man that is clean shall gather up the ashes of the heifer, and lay them without the camp in a clean place, and it shall be kept for the congregation of the children of Israel for a water of separation. It is a purification for sin. And he that gathereth the ashes of the heifer shall wash his clothes and unclean until even, and it shall be the children of Israel, and unto the stranger that sojourn among them, for a statute forever. He that touches the dead body of any man shall be unclean seven days, and he shall purify himself on the third day, and the seventh day he shall be clean. But if he purify not himself the third day, then the seventh day he shall not be clean. Then what? Okay, well, anyway. Um, what is this? It's a double image. Uh-oh. What the truck? <laughs> 